Hey y'all, I'm Laura and welcome back to Confident Notions. So for those of you new here, welcome. I do a good number of Dollar Tree hauls and other haul videos, but I feel like I got a lot of Dollar Tree hauls recently. I don't know why, because I don't feel like I've been there that often. I don't know. Anyways, so myself and these bags under my eyes have a haul video for you. And this year, I'll be honest with you, it's unicorns. It's all unicorns. Um, so recently I just posted the what I'm getting or what I got my four-year-old for her birthday. And today I have the Dollar Tree bag of party decorations. So poor child, last year for her third birthday, she didn't get a birthday party per se because it was all covid -y and all of that. And I had all these adorable like donut decorations because the theme was going to be I do not believe she's three and it was precious. And now I have all these like donut decorations in a box. And I thought about maybe we'd resurrect it for this year, but no. Um, I asked her, I said, what kind of birthday cake do you want? And she said, I want a unicorn cake. So here's what's happening. Uh, so on her actual birthday, I ordered a cake and it's gonna be a unicorn cake and it's precious and adorable and it's just for us. And then also, cause her birthday is on a Tuesday, I'm gonna send some sort of treats to school. I don't know what, I have to ask, like allergies and stuff. Just, I'm not gonna, I can't send peanuts. I don't know, maybe some sort of, I don't know, maybe popsicles, I don't know. I don't know what to send. Anyways, that and some sort of treat bag. I don't know if I told you all this before, but there was one little girl, sorry, I feel like I have an eyelash in my eyeball. So there was one little girl who, she just recently joined the class, but it was, happened to like coincide with her third birthday when she joined the three-year-old class. And her mom sent them kazoos. Like her mom, as the birthday present, sent that child to school with 20 kazoos. And all the kids came home with a kazoo. And I'm like, that's not cool. So I'm seriously thinking about like getting some recorders because I saw some recorders at Dollar Tree. I'm like, I'll buy 20 recorders and send them home with you because you don't send my kid home with a kazoo. Now there's reparations that we got you to look. Anywho, then um, a couple of weeks later, so it's so like the 15th, there's some moms in her classroom who are way more with it than I am when it comes to like coordinating stuff. And we're going to have a joint birthday party for her and like three other kids. Like we're having a May party, which is great. They'll all come. Then we don't have to go to three parties in May. We got one party. It's fantastic. Anywho, so this is the stuff I bought to decorate around the house on her birthday day. So first up, and I did buy these before I knew what the hell was going on. So first off, I got these felt glitter unicorns and now I have gold glitter all over my legs. So look how adorable these unicorns are. So we got some white unicorns and we got some pink unicorns. What I got here, I've got five total. No, I don't, I was like, I did not buy five, that's silly. I got six, I don't, I buy in threes don't ask. It's a problem. So I got three pink unicorns and three white unicorns. And I'm not sure those might go up on the mantle. They might go downstairs somewhere. They might get stuck on the wall. I don't know what's going to happen. But I would tell you, Dollar Tree definitely has a bunch of unicorn stuff. Excuse me. So the cool thing is Dollar Tree definitely has a lot of like unicorn stuff for a unicorn party. The party with the school kids is gonna be like a superhero princess, like superhero princess party. And I'm in charge of decor. So, I don't know, I'll get some masks or something in like capes, right? Then I also got these swirl decorations, again with the unicorn um, and the little happy birthday sign. I got the unicorn happy birthday banner. Oh yes, I did. I usually hang this either like on the mantle and they'll probably hang this on the mantle downstairs. Oh, I got two of the swirls as well. Then I also got these, I got three of these to hang up too. These are these hanging like glitter decorations. And I thought these were cool cause they were iridescent and I hadn't seen the iridescent ones before and I thought that was adorable. So I grabbed two, no, three. <laughs> course I bought in threes. So I grabbed three of those to hang up. There's glitter everywhere. There's glitter everywhere. Just everywhere. Um, 
Then I also picked up these paper straws that have unicorns on them and it says magical wishes. And I don't know what I'm gonna do with these now, but she didn't drink out of them for a month. I don't know, it's fine, that's fine. Then moving on with the last of the unicorn stuff, bought some cake plates. There are 20 plates in each of these packs. We don't need 20 plates, but you know what? We eat small things and we need small plates. So we'll just use the unicorn plates. It'll be delightful. Is this the last of the unicorn stuff? Hmm. I don't feel that's enough. I might need some streamers. I think I probably need to go get some streamers and some balloons and stuff like that. Um, but then I also picked up these. Let me fix this spotlight that's fallen out here. Um, it's called tabletop decor is what they're branding it as and i thought this would just be really cute on the table so it says magical vibes it's got little lights in it um pull off the tag and look it lights up oh it's precious so i thought that would be super cute just to kind of put on the table with the other unicorn stuff and i did pick up two of those i think that's the end of the unicorn like the actual like party stuff I also, I, but I did find this really cute unicorn set. So it's a unicorn stationery set with a mini notebook, two sticky notebooks, and a gel pen. And I thought that was precious. And I've hauled a different version of this, not with unicorns previously. But this one I put in with the party stuff. I am fairly certain I haven't hauled this back yet. I'm having a moment. Pretty sure I haven't. You'll let me know, right? You'll be like, Laura, you already hauled that like a month ago. It's possible. <laughs> Anything's possible. All right, got some boring stuff here. That's right. Clippy clips, multi-purpose clips. I like the colors of them. These are great for chips. They are great for binder clips. They are great for putting paper together so they don't fly all over the place. Clippy clips. For a dollar, you get six of them. These are cute, all right? Um, I also picked up more of the AAA batteries. There's glitter in my eye now. These, I like having these AAA batteries. I use these to light up like the fish light in my Beta's aquarium. But I tell you, these last about a day. I put three of these AAA batteries in there and it lasts about a day and a half. And I need a better solution because as cheap as these things are, it's not cheaper than electricity. So I need a better, better, better path there. Um... Speaking of the birthday girl, I saw this messenger bag while I was there and I, well, first of all, I like the colors because it's pink and it's black and it's white and it's black and white, right? But she likes putting things in bags and carrying them around. As a matter of fact, she went and got a bag from my room, from my bedroom, not too long ago, like an hour ago and said she was going to the mall and proceeded to put some toys in it. So she could use this instead of my bags. I also found some stationary stuff. This is Laura awkwardly moving closer to the camera to reach. But I found these really cute notebooks. Look at these. It says smile and shine. I love the colors on these. So just really, really cute with the lime green, this coral color, this like light baby pink, the teal, um, and then like the light blue. Really, really cute. I love how they coordinate. I'm sorry, the knob is digging into my back here but i just love how how this coordinates so well together and if you wanted to make up like a little gift bag or something it'd be hella cute you get 80 sheets in here and i also like that they're a spiral bound notebook you yeah, know complaints about a spiral bound notebook um these here these are mini gel pens i know these were out at like easter time and they were in this bag and i think these might have been left over from before I feel that she's had these and has already lost them once. So we'll just put those over there. It'll go for her birthday trip. She's something else to play with. Speaking of something to play with, on her birthday trip, I picked up this sticker puzzle book. So it's unicorn stickers and puzzles. Um, she's not so great at like following directions when it comes to stuff like this. So she knows her numbers and she knows to match up numbers, but she just doesn't care. So I thought that was cute. Anything else? Oh my gosh, sorry. The thing is digging into me. All right. Now I got a little bit of like office -y stuff. Actually, I take that back. One last kid thing. Frozen headband. I think she already owns this as well somewhere. But um, things about little girls is they lose headbands like it's nobody's business. So 
just keep them stocked up. Now, I did also find some crafty things. Um, sorry, I heard the thunder of little feet and I was like, it's everything put away. Okay, so I picked up some more beads. So we picked up these 400 pack of beads here. This is just multicolored beads. There she is. Hi. What are you doing? I, I want you. You want me? For what? <laughs> I'm going to come make a video. You want to come make a video? Okay. Well, what's, what's this? Beads. We got beads. What's this? Um, More beads? rainbow beads. Rainbow beads. And what's this? Um, more rainbow beads. More rainbow beads. We got plenty of rainbow beads now, right? Oh, what's this? Beads. More beads. What do we do with beads? We put them on necklaces and bracelets. That's right. We put them on necklaces and bracelets. I like beads. She might be back. Okay. <laughs> to go along with the beads, I had not seen this before, but they had stretch, the stretch lace. It's not lace, right? It's stretch elastic for the beads, right? So I thought we could use this to string the beads on. You get a good amount of elastic here. You get five yards of each color. That's a lot of elastic. So I picked up two packs of those. And then I also picked up another one of these Crafter Square storage boxes because I bought a lot of beads and they need to go somewhere, even though this box isn't big enough for all of those beads. I figure you can't go wrong, right? These are small things. We got smaller beads or less beads. That can go in there. Ooh, I was also really excited to find these here. This is, we're calling it just an organizer, but this like almost like this clear Lucite Essentials organizer box. I really like the look of these. They don't stack. I'm surprised I only have two, um, but I, this is good for organization for in here. Um, so yeah, I thought that was really nice. And I just really like how like clean it looks. And it's pretty big too. This thing is, I don't know how big it is. It doesn't say. It's big. It's like big as my head. Right? <laughs> um, last couple of things here before a little miss something something comes running back in here. These I found a while ago, and I'm sure y'all have seen these, but these cross stitch I think are adorable. This is a cross stitch fun for kids. You get six pieces of yarn, right? And then you take it and it's not, I wouldn't call it cross stitch. This is like the, um, shoot, it's like that plastic canvas. It's like plastic canvas mesh. Again, I wouldn't call it cross stitch per se, but it kind of is, I don't know. I think of cross stitch is a little bit different, but I guess you make an X on it, so whatever. Um, but yeah, I thought this was really cute. Just a little something to get bored. That's not for her. I would do those. Maybe one day I'll do all of the crafts that I have hoarded. Maybe one day, maybe. This also goes with the notebooks, but I didn't, speaking of it, I it says get stuff done. Speaking of the crafts and that that I need to do, which just languish away. I thought maybe I could just make a list of it instead. The more lists I make, the more it'll just birth it into existence, right? So I like that, get stuff done. Then last couple of things, I feel this is kind of all over the place. It's because my child came in and like, she's precious, I love her dearly. Um, but she throws off video. I also picked up this. So it is a unicorn change purse for her to put her monies in. I thought that was really cute. Again, we'll put this in a little bag for like her trip. So when we go on her little birthday trip. Uh, this is boring, but it's a, it's a sugar scooper. And I am oddly excited to have this. And for some reason I have not had a scooper, a sugar scooper in my sugar canister for like my adult life. And I don't know why. I haven't done that actually. I don't know why I don't have a scooper in every canister. Poor life choices. So I picked up one of these and now I say this, I think I need one for the flower as well. And last, but certainly not least, oh yeah, 
I got me a Baby Yoda cup. Because I love me some damn Baby Yoda. As cute as they ever. So I saw this cup and I know I purchased two of these and I put one downstairs somewhere that I haven't seen. And I kept one of them up here in this bag so I could haul it. No idea where it went. So, anywho, that's all I got. So if you like videos like this and small children, adorable children getting ready for bed and busting in, then gosh darn it, you are in the right place. Um, I would super duper appreciate it if you like, comment, subscribe, all of that good stuff. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're staying safe. And uh, yeah, I'll see y'all soon.